Hello YouTube Nation, this is Tony Charest. I love the political seasons that we have every two to four years. I love watching the banter between the Republicans and the Democrats, seeing who could actually out-banter each other, uh, give the best policy statements, and whatnot. So, and I will preface to say I am a Democrat. So, I've been watching the Democratic National Convention for the last three nights and night number four. I have seen quite a few good speeches. I saw Joe Biden give a great speech. I saw Barack Obama and Michelle Obama give great speeches. I saw great speeches by Kamala Harris. Uh, and I also saw the speech that Tim Walls gave. The Wednesday speech and I went to bed that night. I loved every minute of the speech. I thought it was a great speech. Went to bed that night, got up, did my normal stuff on Thursday. Friday, I get up. And I have to say one thing. What undivine inspiration made MAGA supporters go absolutely batshit hateful on Tim Walz's son. Uh, one comment said, somebody give this boy a tampon. Another one said, oh, he's crying like a little bitch. Another one said, this special needs son needs to actually be a little bit more dignified and blah, blah, blah. I think this is the most abhorrent behavior I have ever seen toward anybody, let alone a man's son. Over the past years, we have made it a policy that you do not attack the children of any candidate, especially, especially minors. This young man is a 17-year-old son of Tim Walls. He was shown given a motion during the pre vice presidential's uh, speech, which is all right. Uh, I had the waterworks going just as well as anywhere else because I loved everything I saw. But to actually have people with such hateful hearts to actually say, somebody get this kid a tampon or this special needs kid needs to be supervised more, I think is abhorrent behavior. Never in the history of American politics have we ever, ever went after anybody's children. I think it's the abhorrent behavior. I think MAGA has gone just way too far. And I think these people need to apologize to Tim Walls immediately, if not sooner. Now, I don't really get too involved in the politics. I never have online. I have in person, but I, I am sorry. I think this is abhorrent behavior. The reason that this actually strikes me so close is because... I know people with special needs sons. I have a sister and her son has Down syndrome. Now, I don't think anybody should ever make fun of him because of it. He's a, an adult male in his 20s right now, old enough to buy beer and to actually enjoy the riches of being adult male. But never ever ever has anybody in our family ever ever made fun of him because of his disability in fact every time i go over to visit with him i treat him just like he would be just a regular person sometimes i go over and offer him some advice like one time i thought it upon myself to actually show him the proper way to give handshakes to people so he could be more respectful so, this kind of strikes a little home for me. I think it's a boring behavior. I think, the Dem I think the Republican Party should take a look at itself and say, what have we become that we actually have to go after some man's child? I just think it's a boring behavior. I think they should apologize. And that's all I have to say about this. I thank you for listening and goodbye. Besides, oh, one other thing. This will not be the last video I post. I'm sorry I'm getting a little bit more into the game right now. So buckle up. 
it's on.